guys so guess what i am back and if you noticed um it's a new setup going on it's a new setup going on yes ma'am so basically um i moved into my new home me and my husband and the biggest thing that i wanted to do was create my office space create my filming space so as you can see that is what we have going on it is not done but be patient so anyway so the first video as you can see my hair is looking a little crusty i don't know if you can see all this stuff in here but i got stuff falling out and junk going on because it's, it's, it's a little raggedy so this is what we're about to do we're about to do an updated wash and go routine and i'm about to show you the products that i'm going to go ahead and use because i am gonna wash my hair off camera so the first thing that I'm gonna go in with is the Moisturizing Shampoo. This is by um, Pink, Luster's Pink. So yes, this is the first thing that I'm gonna go in with. And then I'm going to go in with the Blueberry Bliss Reparative Hair Mask because my hair was blow dried and um, I need to make sure that it is back strong. All right, so I'll be back as soon as I wash my hair and yeah. Okay guys, so I just came back from washing my hair and um, it's still dry. It took me drenching my hair like maybe four times for it to, you know, like saturate with the water and lather up with this conditioner. This is a moisturizing conditioner for the most part. Like it says it's moisturizing. Um, I like it, but so anyway, so what I'm about to do is I decided to do my hair mask on camera because I need to detangle my hair. So it looks like it's literally like butter kind of-ish. Um, no, it is butter. That's what it, the consistency of it. So let's start, I think I'm gonna do a side part. Okay, so there's my part. Okay, so I did try to go in with my Felicia Leatherwood, I think that's her name, brush, but I don't recommend this brush for like detangling your entire hair. It's, it's really just when your hair is already detangled and you're just going through it one more time to make sure you ain't got no kinks and knots because that ain't it for me. So, um, I don't have my spray bottle. I should probably get that, but yeah, I need my spray bottle for sure. Yeah, I'll be back guys. Okay, so I'm back with my spray bottle. I have warm water in here because I'm low porosity. Should just get that moisturized in. Okay, now let's go in. Also, I am, um, oh shoot. I'm gonna go in with another deep conditioner on top of this, which is the Texture ID Deep Treatment Protein Mask. Always start from the ends and work your way up. Okay, no heat damage so far. I thought I had it, y'all, I really did. Twist this up. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and put this deep conditioner throughout my head and then I'm gonna come back after I rinse it out. But yeah, so I'll catch y'all later. Hey y'all, so I'm back and something happened. It's like three days later, two days later, one of them days. And 
I'm just now rinsing out my deep conditioner. Okay, so this is how my hair looks. I know it's three days later, but it's so soft. And y'all, my hair was so soft. Like, I kept it in a low ponytail side part, but my hair was so soft. Y'all wouldn't even believe it. It was so soft. I want to start in sections. Cause to me, sections are easier. And I'm gonna be honest y'all, I kind of fell out of love with wash and goes. And the reason being is because I just feel like they get so matted easily. But it's all about the care. And I know I can get lazy. Oh, I ran out of clips. Oh, no, I didn't. I know that I can get lazy. All right, so let's start on this section right here. Again, I have my warm water. Just warm it up. Because once, you know, the water hits the air, that warmness is kind of gone. But... Yeah, so I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna take my dimming brush and just detangle it. Remember, start from the ends up. Ooh. Okay. So let me let me show y'all the products that I'm using today. And I actually don't want this one. I mean I feel like it's restricted. So Style Factor Edge Booster Gel. I've never used this. This is the pineapple scent one, $16.99. It comes with a little scooper or whatever. Then I'm going in with the main choice three in one revitalize and refresh conditioner. And then I'm going in with the Mayo Mio Organic Curl Sculpting Custard. Now, I do love, you know, I won't say love, but I enjoy her products or whatever, um, but they don't always work on my hair. So, but this is great. I'm gonna link my summer wash and go that I did with this and another product by The Main Choice, and y'all, that jump was fly as a mug, okay? But this is great for shine, like, I can't even lie. It's so moisturizing and it's for shine. This is my leave-in. You know, your leave-in is important. I don't always... Whoa, that was probably too much. So this is my leave-in. I already know it's gonna have great slip. I don't, um, I don't always use a product that is specifically a leave-in. I just look for a great uh, cream or something. You don't always have to uh, use a product that says leave-in conditioner just because it says leave-in. Okay, I love the way this smells. So this is the Curl Sculpting Custard. Probably can't see it. Ooh, it's so moisturizing, y'all. Get those roots, too. Look at my curls, already popping. And then I'm going in with the Edge Gel. Oops, not <laughs> shooting out of word. So this consistency is Thick, but not too thick. Like, it's not cakey. I already like the way that it's clumping my curls. Ooh. All right. 
right, now I'm just gonna do this method all over again. Hey, okay, so I'm done. Um, I'm gonna give you like a little 360. I'm about to go in with this Barra Edge Control and y'all this is black owned for one. Shout out to Sarah for creating this product and it's literally the best edge control that I've had my hands on. Like top three and this is probably number one. <laughs> number one best edge control that I've ever used. So. Y'all know what we already about to do. <laughs> Come on, let's zoom in. Yes, sir. Thank you guys so much. Remember to comment, subscribe, like this video, and thank you again. All right, bye guys.